Hey, what's going on, guys? Simon in here, and today I'm going to show off the uh, combine uh, factory here. It's pretty much the same as the regular one. I just redesigned it for, uh, just to say, uh, military applications. <laughs> it's not all military, military, uh, but basically, uh, we have our uh, advanced factories and stuff in here. Nothing too fancy here. Radiation absorbers, stuff like that. Now the real big ticket item of this place is the good old uh, thermo, uh, the uh, nuclear missile. Which uh, I don't know, man. It's been set over to a village. Um, go to a village over here. And we're gonna see how well this holds up to a uh, nuclear explosion. We have uh, we did have to redesign the uh, smokestack because the original factory smokestack was not big enough to let any nuclear or any missiles through. I've tested it with EMP missiles. Obviously, I don't want to just swing it when it's done. <laughs> anyway, let's get right into it. So, say you have a a, a bunch of pesky uh, pesky neighbors. Oh, freaking for I dropped my detonator. I dropped my detonator. Okay, you know what? Let's make another one. Stuff like this always happens. Anyway, look at that. We got a nice window here so we can actually look at our lovely missile. A little over here so we can actually switch out missiles and stuff. So I'll do Crete and do Crete bricks and combine bricks. Alright, anyway, let's get right into it, shall we? Ah, oh, this poor village. Look at all these stupid villagers. Here we go. <laughs> da, 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 da. I do say this actually held up better than I was expecting. Let's get a Geiger counter. Let's see how much environmental radiation we have. And on here, that's good. That's what exactly how I wanted it. And right here, mmm, it's bad. But the radiation, the radiation absorbers are doing their job, <coughs> and the base held up surprisingly well. There's a little bit of radiation over here in this corner. I think the radiation absorber just sucked that up as well. It's honestly not bad. You can still live in here. 10 out of 10. Not any barrels blew up. That's... I didn't really think about that happening. Till now. Uh, all in all, pretty good. Pretty good. Now, uh, there's one part of this that is obviously going to be contaminated. And that's going to be this area here. But if you don't go in here, you should be fine. But all in all, I, I mean, it held up pretty good considering it was pretty close closer to the explosion than I anticipated. That's a deep crater. Look at that. Ooh. Radiation here is terrible still. All in all, 10 out of 10. That is the combine uh, factory uh, bunker um, base thing. Even the floor is made out of freaking Ducrete. Very nice. So honestly, <laughs> I guess. As you can see, the fallout is going. Through, so a good uh, modification to have would be like a silo door, because that part of it's gonna be very highly radioactive. Okay, and maybe not. Maybe not too bad. Oops. See, it's honestly not that bad. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time.
goodbye.